，你要把你的重担卸给耶和华，他必抚养你，他永不叫一人动摇。诗篇五十五二十二。Cast away. Are you overwhelmed by the weight of a burden you were never meant to carry? Let the timeless words of King David, inspired by the Holy Spirit, sink deep into your soul. Cast your burden on the Lord, and He will sustain you. He will never permit the wretches to be moved. Psalm 55:22. The word "cast" in Hebrew means to throw, hurl, shed, or fling. To propel something as far as possible, to sling something out of your sight. God wants to carry your burdens, but you have to cast them off. So don't just half-heartedly set down your burdens or passively give them to God. Cast them at His feet. Prayer, Lord. I'm grateful for the promise that I can cast my burdens upon you, knowing that you will sustain me and uphold me. I come to you with the burdens that have weighed heavily on my heart, Lord. You know the worries, the fears, the anxieties that have been troubling me. I cast them all upon you, for you are the source of my strength and my. Refuge, in Jesus' name, Amen. Scripture, 你要把你的重担卸给耶和华，他必抚养你，他永不叫一人动摇。诗篇五十五，二十二。Cast your burden on the Lord, and He will sustain you. He will never permit the wretches to be moved. Psalm fifty two fifty five. Twenty-two. Honor God. God is able to support us when we are weak, and strengthen us when we feel weary. Spend a few moments focusing on how strong and powerful He is, and give Him whatever praise comes to mind. My concerns. Faith is the sword of the Spirit, the sword of the Spirit, the sword of the Spirit, the sword of the Spirit. 希伯来书十一一。What are you hoping for today? Bring to God whatever is on your mind, and allow Him to fill you with His hope and peace. My response: 我将这些事告诉你们，是要叫你们在我里面有平安。在世上，你们有苦难，但你们可以放心。我已经胜了世界。约翰福音十六三十三。What has Jesus overcome in your life? Sit with this question for a few moments. Give yourself permission to reflect on God's faithfulness and respond to Him. Closing. All glory to God, who is able to do far more than all that. We could ever ask or imagine. Take a few moments to process this time with God before going about the rest of your day.